Well, I'm in the process of making a logo, a CAD logo for a landscape company called Keystone. I've made a screen grab and taken a copy and image file of the logo and I'm trying to recreate it over here on the right. I'm having some difficulty matching colour. If I select here, I've got colour 12 selected, but it doesn't quite match the colour that I see in the screen grab. So what I'm going to do is to save that image file and open it up in EFN View and then get the precise colour from EFN View. If I pick our current colour and go here and to select colour and true colour and say select true colour, we can actually type in the red, green and blue values and then we'll get our precise match. But we need them how to get them. Well, what I'm going to do is switch to EFM View, which is a free and very good image editor. Well, here we are in EFM View, and if I go Image, come down here to Replace Color, and then I'll just move that out of the way for the moment. Click in here, and you see it's picked up, EFM View has picked up the RGB values of the red in the logo, and it's 25358 and 4. I'll jot that down, 253, 58 and 4, and then I'll, I'll cancel from there and I'll switch back to GK Plus and type in here red value of 253, green value of 58 and blue value of four and we can okay that and okay that I'll say unselect all can you see now the color of this polygon matches exactly the color in the keystone landscapes image and I can just go modify match properties pick up the color there and match it to there and now we have a logo with our color matched quite nicely you might argue I've could perhaps make the outside border here a darker black colour. So let's swing back and see if we can get the RGB values for that. If I select the outer zone here, you can see the colour is RGB value 9, 9 and 9. So by using if and view, we're able to match colours in any image file we like to capture and use it in the GK Plus environment.